Well, good day and thank you for tuning in. I trust that you will have a wonderful day today. I would like to share with you a scripture found in the book of James 4 verse 4. And here we read the following. You adulterous people, don't you know that friendship with the world is enmity with God? And therefore, if you choose to be a friend of the world, you have chosen to be an enemy of God. Now, I don't know about you. I don't want to be an enemy of God. I would rather be his friend. But there are some requirements. In John 15, 14, we read that that requirement is to obey his commandments. Then we will be called his friends. Now, one of the commandments that I'm thinking of is to love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul, mind and strength and your neighbor as yourself. You see, there's a lot of self-love going on in this world, but there isn't love for one's neighbor. And if you say that you love God, you should have love for your neighbor. God proved his love for us while we're still sinners. And he died on the cross for us. And so greater love the world hasn't seen than the love of God being proven by Jesus Christ laying down his life for his friends. Now we need to understand that being a friend of God is not being selfish. And that's why James actually starts in chapter 4 from verse 1. He says that there are fights and quarrels amongst you uh, because you have selfish motives, selfish desires. And you ask God for what you want but then you don't receive because your motives are selfish. And then he says, you're adulterous people, you unfaithful people, because you see, the way of the world is selfishness, and being a friend of God is not being selfish. And so with that in mind, let's pray together. Father God, I say thank you that you want to be our friends. And Lord, we don't want to be your enemies. We want to obey your commands. Help us this day, Lord, to love our neighbors as ourselves. Help us, Holy Spirit, to love the Lord our God with all our soul, mind, and strength. Lead us this day. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in, and may you have a wonderful day. In Jesus' name.